How easy are y'all gonna make this? I'm gonna see if I just pull their feed over there, their feed barrel here. Come on. They may very well walk right up in here. Those are the three. Those are the three that I need in here. The one, the sour keeping. She's that fourth one back there who's not really coming up here. Come on. Just you two. Let's go. There we go. That's what I needed. Nope, they're going to jump right back in. All right. If I throw some feet up in there, they're all three going to hop up in there. Then I'll just have to keep this one out. And I got some white on her back, so just so I would know who she was. See, I don't, I don't want her up in there. Which, if I could get all four of them in there, getting her out would probably be easier. Now I just need this one to get up, get up in there. Come on. And <laughs> one comes out. Of course. Well, I don't want all of them to come out, so... <coughs> I'm gonna get some feed and put it up in there. I bet they'll just hop right up. I'm filming this on my phone today because I don't have my camera with me. Let's see how just like one scoop of feed does. What's up ladies? Lady cow is out here. I'm waiting for Sheila, the white one, that Charlet cross. We're still waiting on her to have her calf. Oh, look. Let's see, come on, hop up in there. They're not gonna want to. Watch this. Come on. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> they all jumped back out. Come on. I'm gonna get some more feet up. This side. Oh, that's a three I need. I can't get out now. <laughs> this door here is, is locked, so I gotta figure out how to get around them without them jumping out. There we go. Just like that, and boom! Got him in there. <laughs> all right now I just gotta now they're all four in there I need to get the one there with the white on her back I need to get her out not quite sure how I'm gonna go about that but I'm sure it'll be more difficult than I think it will be that's what I need to do I need to get all three of I need to get all of them back there and get the, the mama out here Let's see if I can hurt him back there. <laughs> Working on this separation. Come on. I want you to go. 
that way. There you go. That's where we want you to go. Now we're gonna get in here. Let's see if we can get this one to come out without letting the other three out. This is uh what'd you call this? Like pig separation 101? I don't know. She's the, the mama here, she doesn't really care to move a whole lot, but she's being a little easier at this moment. Maybe. They're really liking all this uh, cattle poop that's in here. This is going to be trickier than I thought. I'm slipping and sliding around in here and all this manure. Here's something I didn't consider at first. I can just have them all up here and see if I can get her just to come out that door without letting the other ones out. That was easy. There we go. She is separated. They all just walked back there. So now you can go right out and I'll give you a little push. Just like that. We're done. We're done loading the pigs. That took, that took, um, well, actually I've been recording that whole time. That took 10 minutes, 10 minutes to get all the pigs in the trailer separated and got the one we're keeping back out so we're, or, I mean, we're done that's easy it's that easy i'm gonna move this trailer up a little bit and hey huge thanks to jeff and darcy from smith family ranch letting me use their truck and trailer to get these pigs to the butcher since our trailer is not quite road ready yet big friends of ours thank you guys so much we love your friendship and i mean couldn't be happier that we've met you guys. Y'all have helped us out. Y'all have helped us out a lot getting our farm all set up these past seven months. We've been here for seven months. All right, I'm gonna get this trailer pulled up and I gotta get this line back up so she doesn't try to get out over there. And then maybe later today we move Mr. Chris McCarty in with her. I want her to have a friend. I want him to have a friend too. He's been alone since we got him. Okay, I'm gonna see how easy Mr. Chris McCarty wants to move. We got our mom over here now. She's just hanging out in her area. I'm gonna try this. I don't know how well it's gonna work. I got a scoop of feed and I raised the line up I'll show you I, lay, I raised the line up right here I'm gonna and it's just a straight shot so he's right there I can open that gate maybe he'll walk right along with me I'm, I'm really hoping I mean, I mean honestly it's probably not gonna work out this way but maybe he'll just walk straight along with me because I got the feed and he hasn't been fed today and he'll just walk right in there let's find out all right, Mr. Chris, you're gonna get your freedom out of here today, hopefully. You follow me where we need to go. Hey, you see this from Veed? Come on. Hey, I got it right here, let's go. He's, uh, I'm gonna speak too soon here, but he's typically, has been pretty good at just following me. Hey, buddy. Come on. Come on, man. Let's go. 
he hasn't been out of the round pen in about two weeks, maybe three weeks. So he might get a little distracted here. Hey, oh buddy. Yeah, come on. <laughs> hey, come on. <laughs> Come on, Chris. Yeah, I knew this was gonna happen. He wasn't gonna wanna follow me real quick. He's real excited to be out of the round pin, though. If only he knew that he's got a lady over here waiting on him. Ooh. Get after it, man. Okay, I think I gotta put this phone down and, and go wrestle him in here. I got some feeds for you. I got you a lady. He'll be rutting up my ground right here. So at this point, I just got to get him to go under that line. Oh, come on, man. There we go. There we go. It's not turned on right now. So there we go. He's in there. Now to let this line down where it needs to go. We will tighten it up here at the corner. Now, this area right here, the four lady pigs have been on for a few weeks. Um, I just opened, you can, you can see this line right here. I just opened this area up to him last last weekend, so four days ago. And I'm gonna move these two, Chris McCarty and the, the mama pig. They're gonna get moved right up here in this area that I've kind of mowed down already. Uh, maybe not this weekend, although it would be better to move them sooner than later. I just don't know if I'm going to realistically have time to move both of them and their whole paddock uh, this weekend with some other things we have going on. And we got to get the bull moved over with the ladies. I'm hoping, really am hoping that he's just going to follow me. He's out there. That's him right there. So we got to come from that pasture across the road all the way around and hopefully get him to follow me straight through here and into the cow paddock here and then in another week we'll move all of them back over towards uh, the other end of our front pasture so hey we got the pigs moved and that didn't take too long at all i'm happy i'm happy for uh this morning's uh chore that that project to be done and be pretty easy pigs will do just about any will go and do just about anything you want them to or at least fairly easier to steer them how you want them to go if they're hungry. They're motivated by food like a lot of us. Wrong side there, buddy. Well, that was fast. How was that, man? <laughs> Yo, they just did the deed, y'all. Like, I put him in here and, like, Within 10 minutes, he's done the deed. I didn't, I don't know, are pigs always in heat? I know that another one of the feeders was in standing heat a couple days ago. So, I mean, I guess it would make sense that she happened to be, but <laughs> look at these two love birds. You two love birds. Chris McCarty's out of it now. He's ready for a nap. <laughs> that was good, dude. Good job. You gonna go again? Oh, he's gonna go again. Nah, you're too tired, dude. You ain't got it. You ain't got it. Okay, y'all. Well, um, we had pig intercourse 101 today. It's the first time to experience that. He's still trying, too. He's, uh, he's too tired. I... I feel you, dog. I feel you. 
Round two is not a thing. <laughs> Alright, sorry if that's a little bit too graphic for you guys. That this is farm life. This is uh this is what we do.